I'll show you how to change the email address on your Xbox account. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing. And once you've done that, then please consider leaving a like. And let's get right into this guide. You can follow this guide either on a mobile device or a computer, they're exactly the same. So what I recommend doing is coming off your Xbox and onto another device. And then what you need to do is go to xbox.com just like so. And then once you go here, you'll get a page which looks something like this. It'll probably be slightly different. What you firstly need to do is go and sign in to your Xbox or Microsoft account. So go to the top right and go and tap on sort of the account icon like so and it will go and take a moment to load and it's going to go and take us to the sign in page. So what you'll need to do is go and enter your current email and then your password. And then after you've signed in what you then need to do is go and click on your profile icon again in the top right and you then need to go and click on my Microsoft account like this. So this will then take you to the sort of Microsoft account details page. So just be patient, it's gonna take a moment. And just like that, it's now gone and loaded. Now go to the top of the page, and as you can see, I've got the option for your info in that top navigation bar. You may, may need to go and click on the three dots to go and view it, but for me, it's already visible. So click there. And this is then gonna go and show me all my information uh, about my Microsoft account. And what you need to do is get, go down to account info, and then email address. And what you want to do is in the top right of the account info section, there's an option for edit account info, tap there. It's then gonna go and take a moment to load and you may need to go and verify your email. Once you've got and completed the verification process, it will then take you to this page here, which is manage how you sign into Microsoft. And what you need to do is go down to account alias. And as you can see at the moment, it shows me my current email. So what we first need to do before we can go and change it is go and add another one. So go and click on add email like this. And what we need to do is either go and create a new email address, which is an Outlook one, or what you can do is go and add an existing one, which is what I'm going to do. So I've just gone and typed in my email and I'm then gonna go and tap on add alias like this and just wait a moment for it to load. And then as you can see, it's now showing in this list here. So what you first need to do is go and verify the email like this. And then after we've gone and verified it, then what we can do is go and change it to our primary email. Once you've gone and verified it, you may need to go and refresh the page just like so to go and update that you've gone and verified it. As you can see, it now is because the verify option is gone. So then all I'd need to do is go and click on make primary like this. And then it says this will be the alias that appears on your Microsoft devices. You can sign in with any of your other aliases as well. So there we go, guys. That's what I'd need to do. And then it's going to be my primary email. So if you guys found this useful, please consider leaving a like. Peace.